<laughs> well, hi everybody. Thanks for joining us on Logistics Executive TV. We're here at the Atlantis on the Palm, beautiful Dubai, and we're here at the FIATA NAFL Freight and Logistics Annual Conference, Global Conference. And I'm joined today here by a gentleman from the Ministry of Investment from Saudi Arabia, Majid Al Saudi. How are you? Well, thank you very much for having Shukran. me. Shukran. Thank you. Thank you so yeah, much. Thanks uh, for joining us. Thank you. So you folks have had, you've had a full team here from the Ministry uh, of Investment from Saudi Arabia today and one of the major speeches and panels, which is extremely well done. Um, talk to us a little bit about the key messaging from the Ministry of Investment that you're bringing here today. Um, so thank you very much, first of all, for having me and and, uh, and of course this today is one of the events um, that we, we don't want to miss. Uh, 700 companies when it comes to logistics and also as well as transportation and this is something that we are proudly want to share our uh, achievement and message to, I would say, to the, to the globe. Uh, and just for a small correction, it wasn't only the Ministry of Investment. Yep. Today, we were under the umbrella of Invest Saudi, sure. which is the, the national uh, logo of the, or the brand, the national brand for to uh, promote the investment opportunity in Saudi Arabia. And you had a number of key personnel from different From a different entities, such as uh, we as a Minister of Investment and also Minister of Transportation and also the, the National Development Program for Logistics and Industry. Right. The, the, the reason why I think, uh, as you just mentioned, it was um, perfectly uh, set on, on how we, we, we have a, uh, a one word, we have a unified message. Mm. We, we all agree because we are all related to the Vision 2030. Sure. So the way how it happened, I think it was very consistent. Uh, we, we unified our message. We have a complement each other on how we are going yeah. to present uh, the, 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 what, the messages that we Sure, want. and so many different projects taking exactly. place as part of Vision 2030. Maybe talk to us a little bit about some of what those me mega projects are. Perfect. So um, the, the sequence was moving into the following. Number one is to giving them facts and numbers. I think this is where the Ministry of Investment take a place to, and to let people understand where we are achieving, what are the projects. We have almost, uh, I would say, in, in, in within the Giga projects, the biggest projects that I think have been ever for the last decades. Um, we're talking about billions, uh, uh, more than 100 billion, yeah. 200 billion dollars when it comes to investment. These are on the Giga projects. On the, uh, on the Ministry of Transportation, also they have presented uh, projects for the maritime, for the roads, airports, and all under the privatization program. And I think this is another 100 billion or more yeah. dollar of investment. I, mean, I think just recent, in the last few weeks, you've had a new shipping line announced yes. on the Red Sea. Yeah. Of course, in the last 12 months, we've seen Riyadh Air. Mm. We've got new airlines coming up, new airports. The infrastructure is staggering. The infrastructure is, is really moving on because, you know, Saudi Arabia, from a geographical uh, point of view, we are really, when you said we are connecting three continents, mm. this is what yeah. we, we really are. If we did not capture this and we did not really emphasize on how we can get the benefit of at least this, this uh, location benefit, we, we are losing a lot. Yeah. Uh, today, Saudi Arabia, again, with the vision, diversification of uh, revenues, it's mm. non-oil uh, revenues. There are many streams we need to work on. Yep. One of them, and I think the most important, is the logistics and transportation. Yep. Sure. Uh, to do that, we need to build an infrastructure. And to build the infrastructure, you need the private sector engagement. Yep. So this is a full, let's say, the ecosystem where the private sector will play a very important role. The ministry will, or the ministerial level, will be um, focusing on regulator, on yep. ease of doing business, and enablement. But again, in a, in a, uh, the private sector are the people. So, so many connecting. I've been in Jeddah a lot, mm. as we talked about uh, the, the off record. But uh, I've seen so many industry organisations within the kingdom linking directly into the private sector. Yes. And this is, of course, bringing in enormous investment from offshore. The IRC as well mm. coming in, as well as what's happening within the kingdom itself. Yeah. Uh, Taking consideration, it's not all about, by the way, the value of the investment. Uh, sometimes the value it's the knowledge sometimes the connection is the value yep. sometimes people are the value 
So, um, and, and I think taking into consideration this kind of what we are achieving or what, do, what we are looking for from the private sector, uh, 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 in parallel we are creating a pool of incentives program. And this is another uh, uh, big amount of money we are giving to, to let people understand it's not about the investment, it's about a real partnership with exactly. the private sector. Exactly. Yeah. Fantastic. Well, the presentations today and the information, the data points that you are, you're giving us today were sensational. Exactly. Very exciting. I know your team is here again tomorrow. So yes. this is, I think we've got five or 600 people at this event. It's a yes. very important yeah. event. And uh, we look forward to staying in touch with you. Thank how, you so how would people get in touch with you, Mike? I think through the, the official, uh, maybe LinkedIn, uh, yeah. uh, the link that we're going to share. Ministry it, of Investment. Ministry of Investment yeah. or people, Invest I think, see that down here. Yeah. And you, yes, definitely. Absolutely. And, and I would be always there to uh, to answer any questions. Sensational. Shukran. Thank you, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you for having me. See you, thank you so much. Yeah. And thanks, everybody, for joining us on Logistics Executive TV. Thank you.